Hey guys, you know what I was thinking about today? I was thinking that we have so many double standards when it comes to relationships in this country. And one in particular involves mileage, okay? Mileage is this term that guys use to talk about women. How many men she's slept with, how many times she's had sex. How common is her name at parties and around the water jug and water coolers at work. Mileage. It seems to only happen with women. It doesn't happen with men. Now, I'm not a woman. I don't know how women talk in their personal circles or on the phone. But I know men definitely tend to talk about mileage. And a woman can go from being the most desired thing after one relationship to completely undesirable. I don't want her anymore because now she's been around the block a few times. But what if we had to flip the script? What if men were actually judged based on their mileage? What if we were actually judged on how much women we slept with? How many times we've parked a car in the abandoned lot? Or how many times we went on the beach with women we shouldn't have been with? How many times we've been drunk kissing people up in the club? You know, I'm just throwing things out there because it's an unfair advantage. And it puts women in a very particular position. Because now you find women are, are scared to go out there and date. They're scared to go out there and become involved with persons because they fear for their name. See, when women, when women get involved with men, they have to consider a lot more than just that relationship. They have to consider, well, what if this doesn't work out? Is this going to tarnish my name? Is this going to tarnish my reputation now? You know, what are people going to be saying about me 10, 15, 20 years from now? And, you know, guys have this funny thing about never forgetting. You can, you can have done something in high school with a woman. And if he sees you again, I can almost guarantee the first thing that's going to come out of, his, out of his mouth is, Wow, I remember when we did so and so and so. Or I remember her. She was that bad girl who did so and so and so. And is it really fair? Because guys, let's be honest. How many of us have done things that, <laughs> let's say, are not, not so righteous? How many of us have been involved with women that, you know, it wasn't going anywhere? We do things a lot of time as men and we don't have to pay the price for it. It's unfair, but this is the double standard. And I don't think we should be judging our partners, judging our women, based solely off of mileage. Granted, it's a very important role in terms of uh, filtering who it is you're getting involved with. But I don't think we should hold that label so firmly over everybody's head. We were all young. We've all made mistakes. We've all been lied to. We've all been hurt. We've all been led on and even seduced, maybe. Okay? But forgiveness is very important. Because until we can forgive a person, until we can forgive ourselves, we can never move on from past hurt, from past guilt. And I don't want to see us judging anyone based off of just their mileage anymore. It's about the character of a person. It's about the integrity that they have. It's about the lessons they've learned from all of the past history they have. Okay? So guys, let's try and be a bit more mature, mature about this, okay? Let's actually start looking at the three-dimensional person, not just one side, okay? So guys, hope you've enjoyed this quick little video. As always, if you have, give it a like, give it a share, so someone else can get this message too. Y'all take care.